Welcome, welcome. I hope everyone is showing up in chat today, unless I have to refresh the chat thing again, because that happened last... this past Monday, and it wasn't showing up on chatsies. So, hope you guys are showing up. Let me refresh it just in case. But hello, welcome in, welcome in. Grab your snack, grab your blankie, get all cozy, comfy. So we could get ready and play the game. Uh, I looked up a little bit on the walkthrough because I believe last Wednesday... It's a little confused as to where I was supposed to go next. Because I went to go see Douglas, I think his name is, in his workshop. After getting the key for the back door. And Douglas was gone! Where was he? Did he die? I don't know. <laughs> so I was a little bit lost on where I was supposed to go. So, um, I looked up a little bit on the walkthrough just to see what was the next step without seeing too much spoilers. And guess what, Chatsies? We're supposed to ru run into a doggy. A good doggy. Not a bad doggy. No, a good one. So, that's when we know. We're going the right way. Is we're supposed to run in to a doggy. Hmm. A little pupper. A little old fellow. A little friend. Yes. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna look for a pupper. <laughs> and uh yeah, hello everyone. Thank you for the hydrates. I made sure to do them. Thank you, thank you. Hello, hello. Hello everyone. Okay, you ready? <laughs> That's me running. I did quacka. Ah, quacka. Hi. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. In the baba, yes. In the baba, yes. You're right. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Have a good lurk. Thank you for the snacky. I have a big banana cake. Like, it's literally in the shape of a banana. And it's a cake. But it's the shape of a banana. And it has banana cream in it. I'm gonna open it with my teeth. Don't tell Mr. Foxhound. He hates when I do this. <laughs> Don't tell him. He's not in here yet. He won't know a damn thing. He doesn't- he never watches my VODs. <laughs> he won't know that I opened it with my mouth. You wanna sniff it, Papa? You don't like banana. You don't like banana. You like strawberries. Thank you for the hydrate and the uh, snacky time and uh, praise the babas. Hey, Papa. Pull it down, okay? Mom has to work now. She's gonna play with her friends. Yeah. She's gonna play with her friends on the computer. And, uh, thank you for the nose boopsies as well. Um, taking a bite of my banana. Um, which save is the correct one? Pass the sheep who saved on the first one. I love when she does that. Thank you, past Sheeple, for making future Sheeple, present Sheeple, a lot more easier to do things. Love when she saves on the top one to save present Sheeple from any confusion. Alright, this is where we were. Got how to play this game already. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Now, there's supposed to be... I'm pretty sure I'm on full on bullets also, but I'm gonna do it anyway. But I'm sure past Sheepu already did it for me. <gasps> what did I get? I heard a blingers. Who blinked? <gasps> Thank you for the follow, Big King. Six, eight plus one? Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it, sir. Good one. 
<laughs> uh, <laughs> welcome in. Have a good lurky or hang out with chat if you like. No pressure. I hope you enjoy the game. We just started. Well, started today's session. Let's go look for a poppers. Yeah? Yeah. I know I do this again. Oh, ah, I didn't mean to do it! I didn't mean to do it. I didn't mean to do it. <laughs> they take 10 away from me? Game. I didn't know they did that. I was just seeing what button was my aim button because I forgot because I haven't played in a week. It's just button. <laughs> hey. Hey, Foxhound. What's up? What are you doing? Why are you yelling at me? What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Dad, cheek your teeth. <laughs> Who told him? Who told him? Was it Quack? Bet it was Quack. Quack loves to tell on me. <laughs> of course it was Quack. <laughs> quack! Da -da -da. How dare! <laughs> Thank you, Platty. I'm looking for a dog. I'm sorry, Cryos. It was only a freaking plastic wrapper. It wasn't anything hard or anything, I promise. <laughs> also, hi, Cloudy. Hello, hello. I feel like it's been a while seeing you. How are you? How have you been? Anything new happening? <laughs> Mr. Foxhound, I'm sorry. My handsies are not strong enough. My teeth are, and I open things with them. Okay. I have small baby hands. Unless you want to come over here and open things with your hands, then I have to use my teeth. I understand, but you scissors. <sighs> You want me to get up? You think I just have a poster that I just carry scissors with me all the time? <laughs> Thank you for the boopsies, snootsies. Doggy's not in here. I'm looking for a pupper. That's how I know I'm going the right way. Use a sharp pointy. I don't have any sharp pointies in within arm's distance. Use a spear? I don't have... Oh, I want a spear now. Should I look into investing in buying a spear? I feel like it would be fun. Hmm. Hmm. You know? For... 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 For, uh... Protection. Protection. I have one. It's fun. You have a spear? You would, though. You would, wouldn't you? Gladly. Of course, he has a spear. Okay. Was there a back door in this, uh... Restaurant, though? Was there? I'm gonna check. I've shown you this before. I can't remember. Show it again. Is there a door anywhere back here that I need? I'm scared. Did I go in here? Oh, it's just a potty. I was scared of just the potty. <sighs> stubby, stubby! I should get a Warhammer. <gasps> like the game Warhammer? Hello, your boy! <laughs> Hello, your boy, Mag. Welcome in. You're free to lurk if you want. You're free to hang out with chat if you want. Do whatever you please. As long as it's civil. Am I going the right way? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. I'm looking for a dog. Tell me if you see a dog, chat. He's cute, that. I, I was supposed... I was told, you know. 
There we go, I was struggling to send a message in the chat. <laughs> it's working now! Hello. What the dog doing? I don't know, I'm looking for a dog. You know? I'm looking for a dog. I don't know where though. But I was told by a walkthrough that I'm supposed to run into a dog somewhere. I'm not sure where though. So I'm kind of just running around. Was there a door back here where uh, Douglas was? I think I checked all the doors, but I'm not sure now, so I'm gonna check again. That sound always scares me and thinks it's gunshots. And it's not gunshots, but it makes me think it's gunshots. Oh, yeah, I didn't go in here, did I? Donnie! I will. I will. I will. Ah. Oh, you crashed. <laughs> no, no, no. It's just the sound of the game. Puppers. Hello. Oh, you're a cute the puppers. I like your eyebrows. Oh, follow you? Okay. You got it. You don't have to tell me twice. I'm coming, I'm coming. In there? Coming. Hold on, puppers. I wanna go look this way and see if there's anything I missed. But thank you for leading me the way. I appreciate it very much. I was looking for you the whole time. Just wanna see if there's anything I need. Do I need this rope? Don't need this right now. Ooh, right now. But I need it later because look at the graphics are different than the rest of the graphics. This game doesn't really show shinies, so for them showing that rope like that is amazing. Because they don't tell you when there's things to pick up. They just expect you to touch everything with your hands, you know? Like I'm doing right now, just touching things with my hands. Uh-huh, it's junked, yes, but there's their medicine in it. Hi, puppers. Hold on. Brown pickup truck. Nothing. Okay. Can I give you Pepe? Pepe? I could just walk through you? <gasps> That's not okay. Why can't I just walk through the pupper? Alright. It's not how puppers work, but okay. Ghost dog? Oh, no. Oh, hey, man. Damn. Can I get one of those? Wow. Oh, I forgot. I gotta press the freaking pause button in this game because they freaking make dialogue go by without me consenting that I'm ready. So I have to keep my fingies on the pause button when dialogue happens. Who were the guests? Agent Bria, was it? Just that. Aya is fine. Okay, Aya. Oh, God. See? It goes by so quickly. But one of your friends at the FBI found me. He rang about nowhere. That'll be Pierce. We made a deal. I'll let you exchange BP points for guns. He'll pay me back later, he says. The FBI, Pierce good, Pierce is good for his word. Let me know if anything catches your eye. Thanks, sir. I appreciate it, and your dog is adorable. I'm sad I can't give him pet pets. You got no clip, the doggy? No, I just walk right through him. A sturdy iron box. No, this is a doggy in front of you, Aya. It's a puppers. Dog does not have that dog in the. 
<laughs> You're right. You just walk right through them. Are you gonna? Oh, you're following me. You're such an adorable baby. He follows me and then he sits. Oh, I love him. Give him pets, Aya. Oh, you're the baby. He's your. What's this trap door down here? Huh, Douglas? <sighs> Got cheeses in your pocket. Yeah. He's a baby. M4A1, MP5. How'd you get the license for these? Some I got from a friend in that military group. That's illegal. You wouldn't throw the book at me for my hobby, would you? Alright. He's got track lighting for his gun rack. What's that? For the marvelous collection, very well maintained. You know it. Can can you just give me things for free though, Douglas? I'm kind of like saving your town, you know? Are you not gonna say anything about this trap door, Douglas? No? <laughs> Look at him! He has the best eyebrows. As someone that also has little dotty eyebrows, as myself, I appreciate when I see other dotty eyebrows. I actually... <laughs> I actually modeled Sheepy to have these little dotty eyebrows because of dogs that have little dotty eyebrows, and I always love it so much that I gave Sheepy little dotty eyebrows. That dog posted up of all the guns. <laughs> He's so cute. But still the guns and the dog? You could try, but Douglas might shoot you before you could get out of here. Look at him. Look at him. He's ready. You might not make it out, you know? Hey, Douglas. You need something? Hmm. Tell me about the shelter. Oh! Let me pause because they made things go by. I heard there was a shelter in the vicinity. Shelter? Right. The one that Matilia Group dug to prepare for the nuclear w winter. Yeah. I guess. Huh, I remember that. Is this still in use? Well, now... I heard that some big company bought it a few years back. Wait, just now. Did you hear that scream? Huh? My ears are shot. I didn't hear a damn thing. I didn't hear nothing. <laughs> I wasn't hearing things. It came from that direction. That's the empty house. I thought I blocked that place up to keep people out. Probably some tourist. I'll go check it out. Where's the house? From town center, you'll go through the general store. Okay. But it was locked. But the owner don't trust nobody. Yeah, that's why it's locked. He wouldn't leave me a key. Of course, there's a well behind the garage. You might be able to get into the general store from below. You want me to go inside a well? Okay. All right. It'll stink to high heaven, but it's the best way. I'll show you the way. Thanks, Mr. Douglas. I'll be fine on my own. <sighs> this Aya outfit is very Resident Evil 3 Jill. This is before Resident <laughs> Evil 3 Jill. She copied her. Show me your guns. 
<laughs> you know, the ones on your arms. Just flex for me, Douglas. Which one do you like? I don't know. All of them? All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Um, what do I want? I don't know. Forgot I have this button also. But I would like it if they showed me, you know, comparing to the gun I have already, that would have been nice, you know? That would have been nice. That would have been real nice, but they don't do that for me. Um, I kind of want to get armor first because I'm scared of dying. And the armor gives me more HP, which I highly appreciate. I know animation's nice. Yeah, she does a little posey and she sticks out her hip and then you could see her butt from... We, we looked at it last Wednesday. That's all. <laughs> Resident Evil 3 September, Paradise, um, Parasite Eve 2 December, respectfully. So they were made at the same time. It was just a coincidence. Oh, my snooches. <laughs> what do I want? The uh, HP 20. Attachments 4. Special features quick fire. Okay. Damn. I don't even have enough for this. I don't even have enough for either of them. Says poison, HP recovery, HP plus 20, attachment 6, body armor, in current military use, use, includes emergency first aid kit. Damn. Damn, Douglas, damn. I don't even have enough for these. Okay, fine. Maybe I should buy some recovery because I only have one, you know? I only have one of these things, you know? I don't know what I want, Douglas. I just want all of it. Just want all of it, Douglas. I don't know guns. I don't know what's the best gun to be using. Gauge 12, capacity 3 rounds. I don't know. I don't know. What do I have on me right now? Ah, uh, yeah. What do we have? M93R, whatever that means. <laughs> whatever that means. Semi auto 9mm fires three rounds. Okay. Hello! Hi Ben, how are you? What are you up to? Are you done with work? This has a range of 50 and a rate of 110, 20 rounds. Can I look again? If I could remember that. To see if one is any better. Whoa. I don't know what I want, you guys. People that have more of an understanding of gunsies. Which one is better? Range. I think this has less range than the one I have on me. Ooh. Rifle. That's gonna take all of my points, though, you know? I don't wanna take all of my points, though, you know? This is the one I have. Because it says semi auto 9mm, which is, I think, the, what I have now. Pump action 12 gauge shotgun. Hmm. Maybe. Meh. Hmm. Oh, knife. Stabby, stabby. We don't want that. We don't want that. 
What? Adds M4A1 capacity plus 30. Wow. Maybe I should just get this one. I'm done at work, but my leg went numb as soon as I got in my bathroom. Oh no, at least it, your body waited until you got home. That's a good thing. But get some rest. Lay down. Take a break. Maybe get something to eat later once you've rested. You know? We'll keep you company. I'm gonna buy this one, I guess. I don't know. What do I need again? <laughs> what did I buy? Buckshot, Firefly, or Slug. Okay. Shotgun. Buckshot. Ooh, 12 gauge shotgun scatter shot spreads nine legal le lead shots in a burst. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Thank you. Um, and then I want a healy. Another healer. And another healer. Because I die a lot. <laughs> okay, thanks, man. I appreciate it. Let's try our new gun, maybe. Yes? What makes everything go down? Maybe I made a bad decision. We'll try it out. If we don't like it, we'll switch back. Yes? Yes. We'll switch back if we don't like it. That's all. Bye, puppy! Bye. I'll see you later, okay? Stay safe. It's dangerous in them streets, okay? Okay, be good. Pa pa pa. Oh. Oh, there's a foe. I should have saved before I made purchases. And I didn't because I didn't realize there was a phone because I was probably too busy looking at the dog the whole time. <sighs> Go ahead and use it. And buy a gun or two while you're at it. I bought one already, sir. Hello? Hello? Hey, I, uh... No, no, don't mention it. Huh? How? Something came up and he had to split. When the cat's away, the mice will play. How you doing out there? You may be raking in BP, but be careful. Alright. I'm gonna save in a different slot then, because I don't know if I freaking need this gun or not. And maybe I made a bad decision, because I don't understand how guns work. Is this a bathroom? The door is to the driver's compartment. Oh, that makes sense. I think the whole compartment's gone. Oh, okay. Also, look at that very old computer. <laughs> Back in the day. You guys remember? Do you guys remember? Windows 95. You remember? <laughs> I remember. Flint, show her, boy. Oh, your name is Flint. Flint, be careful. Flint, there's monsters out here. Be careful. Don't want you to have something happening to you. I will cry. what I say, Flint? -a? Oh, this guy hate freaking reloading. Get 
fits a good gun, but damn, reloading after three bullet? Wait, you okay? They didn't touch you, did they? Windows 95, it's all about Windows XP. I know, but the first Windows I had was Windows 95, man. Of course I had Windows XP eventually, but the first one I had was Windows 95. Are you okay? Hmm, now I can take this. Okay, cool. I'm leaving. I'm leaving, Flynn. Go back home. Go. That's right. Walk back home, sir. Where it's safe. Go. Shoot! Didn't you see those freaking scorpions? Alright, I'm leaving. What the hecky? I love it! It's so cool! But I think I should use my other gun for the meantime, because I don't know if this refills up with unlimited bullets like the other gun does. I don't think so. So, go to switch. And use that other gun when I feel like I am in danger. I think we're still on Windows 2.1 when I first touched the computer. <laughs> Are you gonna show me the whole way, Flinta? Flinta, it's dangerous. Who's gonna walk you back home? I have to go in the well. You should stay home. What are you doing in here? I heard a noise and it scared me. I thought there was more monsters. That's a good pupper, yeah, but it's dangerous out here. I don't want him to get hurt. Yes, I'm coming, Flint. I'm coming, I'm coming. Alright, this way, yes. You're right. I'm coming. Yes, Flint. I know where the well is, baby boy. I know, I know where it is. You didn't have to show me. Yes, it's down here. You're right, Flint. Good job. Yes. Alright. Pat, pat. There, there. If you like this game, you should look into... Oh, I'm sure. I don't know how to pronounce that right. Um, it's hilariously fun and technically two-player. It's definitely a product of this era of PlayStation 2 games. Yes, I love this era. This is, uh, PlayStation 1, 1999, and I love it. I love Parasite Eve. This is my first time playing Part 2, though. I played Part 1 as a kid and then I played it on stream. And that game is probably one of my favorite games of all time. After playing Part 1 again. Uh, first time playing part two. I was told not to play part three, but I'm still gonna. Because I want to know why I shouldn't be playing it. It's like a lot like Resident Evil 3 in Parasite Eve if you play as high school kids. Ooh! I'll write it down on my list of things to look into. Thank you for letting me know. It's, dark to s it's too dark to see, but I bet it's steep. Am I supposed to go in here? Flint, what happened? Where am I going? Flinta? Though I had to go in the well, Flint. Am I not going in the well, Flint? What happened?
Rope profined with steel wire, it wrapped around a tire rim. Yes. You. Ah! There we go. Alright, Flint. You stay up here now. This should hold my weight. You stay here, okay? No going down wells. Don't do what I do. I don't like it. <laughs> hey, Aya. This is not the first time we were in a sewer. You remember part one? <laughs> Parasite Eve? You ready, man? Can't wait for Parasite Day. Hmm. Parasite Day was the first one. <laughs> no! No, like it. Don't see. I can't see anything. Can't see anything. <sighs> this is gonna be bad time. I can't get away from the poop water. No. This is what happened in part one. We went down to the cell, the the sewers to follow Eve. Remember? Parasite afternoon. <laughs> Hello. Okay, but what was the other way? I went backwards. Was was the backwards the right way to go? What is this? Oh no. Alright. Oh, can't change guns when I'm like this. Alright. No, that's not what I wanted. Damn. Oh, I might die. I might die. Very, very... Very possible I might die. What? I didn't die? <gasps> oh my god, with like 4% health left. So it probably didn't help that I forgot to freaking put these recoveries into my belt. Because you can't go into your menu when you're in battle. And I forgot. <sighs> oh my god. 
The real parasites from Parasite Eve were the parasites she got from walking unprotected in the sewer. You're right. That's what the whole part one was about. Poop parasites. The real parasites, Parasite Eve, are the food that you can actually eat. <gasps> like peanuts, because I'm allergic. Don't die, it's bad for your health. It is. I agree. I was almost there, but I didn't do it. Isn't there a way to level up your magic or am I remembering? I was about to look into that. You were reading my little baby brain. You were reading my little baby brain. Um ba -ba 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 -ba. Strength. Cost 30? Wait, what does it cost me? Oh, cost experience points, yes. More healies. Um what else do I want? Knocks down targets with a sim that might be good. Just physical damage. That might be good too. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I got more things! I got more stuff! I got more stuff! <laughs> I can't eat pizza anymore, doctor's orders? <gasps> really? Why? What is it about the pizza you can't have? Is it the dough? Is it the sauce? Is it the cheese? Is there anything that we could do to replace one of those things? And then could make it that you could have a pizza in some sort of way? Even if it's not a traditional pizza? Because pizza is important. Pizza brings happiness, okay? Eat the doctor? Yes, we eat the doctor and stay. <sighs> pizza is important, though. How dare he order you not to eat pizza? What the heck? -y? I'm offended. We got more things. Cool. <sighs> I think I just can't have a whole pizza. I could eat most of the ingredients separately, but I think pizza itself is too much. <gasps> oh. <laughs> right! <laughs> Well, at least you- maybe you can have a slice. Eating a whole pizza, then fine. Yeah, maybe you- you shouldn't eat the whole pizza. I sometimes eat the whole pizza. I eat the whole pie. But maybe you could still have a slice. Or maybe if you just don't assemble them, but eat them separately, but in the same meal, maybe. It's <laughs> not too much. Oh, uh, We need pizza in our life, man. It's important. If they eat a pizza, their lungs fall out. Oh, I hope not. They need those too. There's a switch here. Let's turn it off. Turn it on. Light the? Hmm. Okay. I want to go back and see what was the other direction. Oh. There's also this. <gasps> what? Mmm, my soul. Did it hit all of them? Stupid. Hello. Bye bye. Give me more pointers. I think it's because of my inventory had me taking too many painkillers. I'll be fine though. I just eat mozzarella sticks and pepperonis. It'll be fine. That's good. One of my local places actually sells pepperoni-filled mozzarella sticks. It's great. 
Yum. As long as you can have something that represents pizza in some way. Pizza's important, though. Oh, she said the whole thing and I didn't read it. She says something about why boys collect things. <laughs> Building closet. I'll just take a peek inside. An old gun collection. A rifle. The long range weapon of choice in the old west. A German semi auto PO8 handgun. A must have for collectors. Okay, too bad I don't think any of these work anymore. Chessboard and pieces, scattered cards, and poker chips. Okay, but nothing else that we need. This place certainly has a great atmosphere for gaming. It's perfect for all night cave and creatures marathon. D and D, love D and D. Love me some D and D users. Hi, wooden crate. There's something inside. Small box. Anything else? It's empty now. Okay. What's in the small box, Aya? Flare. Inflict darkness. Disposable self-defense weapon used to blind surrounding enemies. Hmm. That's cool. Wine barrels. Made of juice. Lots of juice. Lots of juice. The doctors don't actually die. Juiceless. And funny. Thank you, Demi. Hi, how are you, Demi? What are you up to today? What you eat for breakfast? Uh, the doctors don't actually diagnose us. They are evil wizards that pretend to help us by casting hex on us, then pretending to help us by giving us very expensive tiny pellets filled with trace amounts of healing magic. Yes. They are mean. No like them. No like. We beat them up? Yes? Sand blazing and Tem had nothing for breakfast. You didn't eat breakfast? Tammy. Tammy, breakfast is important, though. You should eat something. To keep your energy. How are you gonna do chaos if you don't have energy? Alright, I turned both things on. Don't know what that means. I want to go down and see if there was anything the other way. Because I did go backwards thinking I was going to meet a dead end. And I think I actually went the way I was supposed to. Okay, but that'll be kind of an interesting plot for something new. Yeah, make it into a D&D campaign. Make it into D and D. Should have counted sheepy. Oh, I operated on four hours of sleep, sheepy. Four hours. Wow. It won't open. Okay, I just wanted to make sure that there was nothing the other way because you know. It will drive my little brain crazy. I love it when you're evil. This is me at my most evil. Do your evil laugh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, evil heapers. I can't operate on four hours. That's crazy. I need at least eight hours. I rarely get eight hours because Bubba likes to wake me up. Bubba wakes me up at two o'clock in the morning for pet pets. He wants me to pet him. He just wants me to get up and pet him. At 2 o'clock in the morning. Every morning. Since he was a baby. Since he was freaking two months old. He's eight years old now. I haven't slept a full night in freaking eight years. <laughs> because of Baba. Ugh, that boy.
Boy is lucky he's cute though, though. Let me pause and do these hydrates. Thank you, Quack. Yes. Yes, continue. Yes, Quack. Thank you. Yes. Four naps to sheep is napping. Yes, I love a four hour nap. I love a four hour nap, you guys. That's a good day. When I could take a four hour I'm nap. Ready. Hamburger. 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 Yes. Hamburger. We'll talk like a, <laughs> we're a whole burger right now. <laughs> Go get yourself a burger. Go make one. Hmm. Four hours, that's a, like a regular sleep? No, it's a nap. It's a nap. I want a hamburger. Everyone gets a hamburger. There's sounds in here. I don't think I appreciate it. Alyssa schedule shipments. Okay. I don't know. I don't know if I want to go through the door. I don't know if I want to go through the door. My meds forced me to get eight hours of sleep. I will love eight hours of sleep. I don't even think I get eight hours, but I will love that. I will love that so much. But again, Bubba does not allow me to do that. <laughs> and then Bubba wakes me up at five o'clock in the morning. Though, he doesn't get breakfast until 6. But he wants me awake an hour before breakfast just so he can make sure that I don't forget. And his way of doing that is just meowing the whole time. So he wakes me up at 5. <laughs> yep. Life with cats. I don't need anything here. Are you sure I am? <gasps> oh, hi. Who are you? You splattered on me? What the hecky? What? You're like little hearts. That just burst. Oh, do I not? Oh, my thing is full. Okay. Then... No. They bursted! They splattered on you without warning, yes! You should shave the top of Bubba's head and make him stop <laughs> No, I would never! Pretty sure those are babies? Those are babies. We're killing babies? Hold on. I need to put my hair up. It came out. <laughs> you do like this, and then you do like this, and then it's a little pineapple on your head. Pineapple. No, pineapple's not working. It's still messing with my headphones. Never mind. We do a bun. We do a bun. We go like this. Then you take your squancy. You do like this. And then all bun. Her hair fell off. Oh no. <laughs> yes, my hair. My hair. Ice cream! It's still frozen. The power must be on. <gasps> Ice cream. Oh, this oh, we're inside the store. Cola on sale. <gasps> Give it. Cola. Oh, my inventory is full. Oh, can I put things in my trunk? Can I put things in my car? <sighs> my sides hurt too much from laughing. Are you thinking about my hair falling off? Like a wig? Hey! Listen! Yes? What is it? What is it, Emmy? What happened? I'm listening. 
I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting for what you have to say. I'm listening. Wow! Wow. Yeah. Wait, is that a real Coca-Cola? It is. This game was sponsored by... Coca-Cola. I'm not sure it was. Don't listen to me. Mm. I love stores and games. They make me happy. Junk food, chips, gum, beef, jerky. Mm -hmm. Never... <laughs> nothing I'll ever eat, mind you. Chips are good. What are you talking about? I, uh... Sweet corn, green peas, corned beef, sardines. A lot of canned food must be popular with the locals. Hey! Listen! Yeah? According to unknown laws, <laughs> there's no way a bee should be able to fly. And its wings are too small to get its fat little body off the ground. The bee, of course, flies anywhere because bees don't care what humans think is impossible. Bees are great. We need bees to survive. They help us. They're little smart little guys. Can't like this game? <laughs> you should have by part one already. Resident Evil 2 was originally going to be sponsored by a Pepsi. Mm, I think I remember that from the, the machine that was in the hallway. They had like a Pepsi machine, didn't they? Fishing equipment. Yes. Instant coffee and tea, plus a breakfast cereal lineup. Okay. No way. Yep. And Resident Evil 2 prototype build. Yeah! Holy shit. Still wish we kind of got that racer girl. Oh, I think I remember that too! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cash register, no traces of tampering. I'll leave some money by the side of the register. Okay. Does this lead me out to where the phone is and where my car is? Unlock the door. Yes, it does. Good, 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 good. Can I... Get some more bullets. And also go to my trunk. Yes, cool. Extra items in the trunk. Uh. Alright. What do I want to leave? Um, this. Um, what else do I want to leave? Out here. Combat line. Damn, I want all of it. Switch. I'm gonna take all of it with me. I like that you can do that. Hmm. Um, let me see what Chad is saying. Elsa Walker? Yes! I remember her! I think we, we put pictures in the Discord a long time ago when we were talking about her the last time. I need more bullets. Yes. Always need new more bullets. My favorite outfit to use when I was playing is clear. <laughs> I was transported to the all add dimension. No. They'll be over soon. They're gonna be done in six seconds. Okay.
Can I rearrange this? Because the way it is, I don't like. Nani. Yes, Nani. Oh, I could sort that. No. Don't like it that way. Do it again. I don't like it this way. I want my guns on the top. It helped me a little bit. Because now I just have to do this. But I wanted my guns on the top. Because I don't u really look at them. And then I wanted my medicine on the bottom. Protein. Full compound medicine. Full HP recovery. Yes, okay. Okay, so we had three more slots. Okay. Thank you. Now I go go get that soda. I'm gonna go get that soda. <laughs> Bullets, yes. Let's go get that soda. Cola! Yeah. See, Mr. Foxhound? It's a real Coca-Cola. Thank you. Thank you for that, bad search. Mm. I'll just take one? No, you need another. <gasps> Ooh. There's more stuff in here that I didn't know there was in here. I should be looking more carefully. Hold on, I'm gonna double check now because... I didn't know that thing was in here. That second item. Also, that door... That we didn't go into. There's a back door. She hates health and loves violence confirmed by keeping medicine on the bottom or guns on top. My made-up Twitch medical degree allows me to diagnose this... <laughs> wow, lots of percentage. Confidence and accuracy. No, it's because I don't look at the, the thingies and then new items come in and then they go in the bottom. So I want the new uh, the health items to go in the bottom. You know? What's in here? Give me the bone melting juice. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I need to go save. I didn't save. Because I didn't know that was gonna be a brand new area. Black pink in your area. Nothing in here. Maps for sale. I already have one of the maps. Okay. Just wanted to make sure. Let me go save. And then go out that door. Having that implant you found analyzed. There's some heavy stuff going on here. Get this. Some of the compounds you can find in any techie shop. Some of them we don't even know what they're made of. But they're organic. Probably high-tech military stuff. I'll keep you posted. Thanks, Pierce. Ooh, go hydrate. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. Yes, ring ring, hello. She must have lots of change in her pocket. You know, she walks and all you hear is the, the change clatter sound. Just, you know, because she has all this change in her pocket. Okay, new area. Yep. 
Yep, yep, yep. Three doors. Scattered morass. So it looks like a holy mountain of souvenirs in there. There used to be a road front property before Douglas put up those fences. I like souvenirs. Hello! It's sheep and chatsies. I see you. Hey, little heart guy. Gee, I sure do love drinking my bone melting juice, especially when it makes my bones melt. <laughs> That's exactly what my thoughts are. Oh no. I hope your bones don't melt. I can't stop drinking soda even though it isn't good for my health. Same, I love Coca Cola. You get used to it after a while, you know? Once you stop drinking it, then you kind of don't crave it anymore. Push cart with some dolls in it. They're really cute, though. Wow. There's the well. It's a quite a long cut. Oh. Okay. What a mess. Don't judge, Aya. People are gone. No one lives here anymore. Okay. Let me see in here. Anything? Cashier. Okay. Was well, there nothing in here? Other than the enemies? Is there anything in there? No. No. Just the enemies. They give me points, you know? Let's guess a good thing. Have... Uh, I have it up for a year before, but then I drink one for my birthday. Oh, then you got back on the addiction. See those exploding babies? Even make baby noises. <laughs> Don't know if they're babies. I hope they're not babies. Hi, Nika. How are you? What are you up to? What are you doing? How you feel? How you feeling? <laughs> I heard screaming. When I started drinking zero sugar soda. But is it really zero sugar or did they just tell you that? Answered on, on exploding baby no No, there's no babies. We didn't kill any babies. Soda? Um, I think he said Coca Cola. The drawback, I think, is the sodium. Mmm, I see. Those babies probably drink soda and soften their bones. That's why they explode so easily. Oh, babies should not drink soda. For that exact reason. 
Skill it'll da, shoot. Da, da. It's not. It's not a skill it shoot. They lied to me. I thought I was safe. Care package, hi. Thank you for the care package. Stretchy. Ooh. <laughs> Sit straight, I guess. Bone issue? Yeah. I understand that part. I understand the bone issue. What? Also, given how food in the body works, nothing is technically sugar-free. Yeah, I heard that all these, like, sugar-free or, like, fat-free things are actually worse than the original thing. That it's better to just drink or eat the original one because the sugar-free ones and the fat-free ones are actually a lot worse for your body. Twitch is sugar-free. <laughs> yes, it's bad for us, you're right. Hello! I don't like the screaming. I don't like the screaming. Don't like... I don't like the screaming. Old bed frame. Wait, there's a drawer attached. I'll just open this in. Nothing inside. Are you sure? I don't like the screaming. Please stop screaming. Sofa's done for cough, thick dust. I don't like it. I don't like. I don't like the yelling. Wardrobe. Something. Just some rat poison. All right. Stop the yelling. <laughs> Sugar-free gummies, eat a bunch of that, and then you gotta run? Do they make you poop? Those having... Who's having a bad time? I don't know. I don't like it, though. Oh, yeah, the sugar-free stuff is usually just made of stuff that increase the chance of cancer. <gasps> Cryo, stop drinking the sugar-free soda. Or maybe a good time? I don't think that sounds like a good time. I don't think that sounds like a good time. But only in California! You're right. Someone upstairs is playing Oxidite Room in the 4. Oh! <laughs> oh, you remember Oxidite Room 104. I think... When did we play that? I think it was for Halloween. My first Halloween. Oh. Uh... Oh, I don't like the screaming. Thank goodness California isn't real. <laughs> you gotta go find the yelling to stop the yelling. Watch the screaming to be an animal. I just I don't like it. Oh, clothes. Yes. Uh huh. I can see a pile of junk cars. All right. I don't like it. I really don't like it. I don't like it at all. Can you push things? Can you push things like in Resident Evil? Scratch marks. Yes, that's what I was looking at. That's why I was wondering if you could push this. The dresser is bolted to the wall. Please stop the screaming. I really don't like it and it's making me uncomfortable. Do I have anything for bolts in the wall? Um... Magnet, yes. Saloon key. Another key. Map. Manual. No, I don't have anything. Don't have anything for bolts. It's just a screaming goat. I don't like it. Nature is not. <laughs> Bomb cats and other big North American big cats screaming sounds like a woman being murdered. Hearing at night is terrifying. Really? That's crazy. 
I don't like it. Nature is nuts. Okay, back to meetings. No meetings! Only play time! Okay, I need to get out. I need to get out of here. I don't like it at all. At all. I don't like it at all. Is there anything over here? Please stop. <laughs> An anti-tank landmine? This should be one of Douglas's traps. Okay. Please stop it. Well, it's too dark to see clearly. That voice is coming from inside. In the dead town of Dryfield, I make it all rain and everyone becomes alive. Yes, water them. Deserted house, the voice is coming from inside. It's locked. I can't... I can still hear that voice. Yes, I can hear it too, and I don't like it. I don't know if I saw anything da, da, da. with bolts that I could... ...open the door with. Huh? Quit reading chat, find the thing. Quick reading chat. <laughs> Why don't you want me to read chat? You guys are the part of what's important here. Chat is, you know? Hmm. Okay. I don't know... So you can silence the screaming. Oh, the screaming. <laughs> the screaming makes me very uncomfortable. I don't like it. Stresses me out. It makes me feel yucky inside. Is there anything to open the bolts in here? Aya, quick. Do your iconic mitochondria-themed backflip. <laughs> she doesn't have a backflip. And then there's all these switches. Oh, no, I didn't mean to go down. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I go back up. I was trying to look at this other switch that was up here. Okay, now you need to ignore the screams. No more screams. They're gone now. Hmm. Hmm. Kinda wanna look at the walkthrough, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna look at the walkthrough. See if I need to do anything with those switches. And see if... There's something I'm supposed to be picking up. Okay, so... We... Found... Where's the dog part? That's where we... Okay, doggy. We went to Douglas. Um, we went to the underpass. Okay, we fought the... The, the little monster guy. That was in there. Is there anything about switches? Um, activate the switch. Okay, so I did that one. And then activate the second switch. Hmm. Okay. Also, those babies are called blood suckers. In case you wanted to know, chat. In case you wanted to know. Both switches should be on. Also, there's one more up the ladder, but it's already set on on. Okay, so this one's supposed to be set on on, and I turned it off. Okay. I don't know what they're for, but... 
This is important for later, they tell me. Now... Hmm... Never gonna give you up. Never <laughs> gonna let you down. Never gonna run around and desert you. Never gonna make you cry. Never gonna say goodbye. Never gonna tell a lie and hurt you. You're right, Tammy. Mm. Uh, okay. Buh, buh, buh. Okay, the sounds are... The screams are close. We wonder how long this is gonna go on for. Yes, you're right. Um... Check the bearings. Okay. Oh, check the cash register twice to attain a belt pouch. What? Cash register. What do you mean there's a belt pouch? You're lying, game. Or do they mean the other place? <gasps> do they mean the other place? Not this place, the other place? Did I said there was nothing in there? Maybe there was stuff in there? Hmm. Maybe? Where's the cash register store in here? I don't see any cash register in... Oh, is it back there? On the other side? Hey, Drita. You're right. Cash register store. <gasps> This game, sometimes you have to press- you have to spam and just press things multiple times and then you find it. Like, you don't find it the first time touching something, you have to press it multiple times. And then she looks multiple times and then she finds the thing. Okay. Anyway. Um, check the dresser in the back. More specifically, the bolts on its side. Do this until it clicks with Aya. Oh, see? You have to click the... the, uh, bolts on the closet multiple times for Aya to say what she needs. And then you have to go to Douglas. Yeah, this game you have to press things multiple times for, like, it to register in Aya's brain that something is there. <sighs> Okay, we gotta go back to the screaming. Gotta go back to the screaming. Sometimes you gotta look more closely when searching for something. I know, you're right. I don't like the screaming. Also, do I have more space? Because... A H A H A H A H G A H G A H U. Whoa, you okay? <laughs> you all right? You doing all right? <laughs> I don't know if I liked it any better. <laughs> like a wrench! There we go. <laughs> okay, that was more hilarious than I imagined. <laughs> you okay? You alright? Okay, we need to go get a wrench from Douglas. Is it this door or the other one? I can't remember now. Yes, this one. Let's 
slay sheepy, but... <laughs> yes? What happened? I'm so full of wrenches. No, you can't eat all the wrenches. We need some of them. Mm, how is she gonna get into the thing without any wrenches? Huh? Tell me. How am I supposed to save the lady? Without any wrenches. Hmm? By waiting a few hours? I'm not... There's no time. She's gonna die. We can't wait for you to poop. Badaya, it's gotta be dangerous out there. I know you have a job to do, but you won't get retirement pay if you get yourself killed. Whatever you do, don't make it personal, like Rupert. I know, I know, he just acts hard, but it's gotta be tough living with memories like his. Who's Rupert? Um, what I'm saying is that there is something to happen to you. I'll have to go on a vendetta and what a scene that'll be. Oh, thanks, Pierce. Pierce cares about me. Hi, Luke. How are you? I'm doing good. Happy to be playing this game today. I'm enjoying it very much. It's another cold, rainy, gloomy day. I feel like it's been raining for the past two weeks non-stop. Every day is just rain, and I don't like it. Can I go this way? I think I could go this way. Good, I'm glad I'm on stage right. I am. I went all... I did all my grocery shopping yesterday. I don't have to leave the house anymore. Right? Yeah. Mr. Sorry. It rains on Earth, it does. It also rains in the sky, because I'm a sheep. I now have sheepies location dot. Please don't. Don't you ever. None of you ever. Let me have my privacy. You have my privacy, please. Oh. Douglas? <gasps> Puppers, hello. How are you? Good job. Hey, Douglas, you have a wrench, perhaps? You need something? Yeah, a wrench. I need information and a wrench. Couldn't get into the empty house. Sounds like someone's in there, but... Huh? Boats? Okay, then. One of my tools from the garage. Thanks. Don't mention it. I thought I shut that door for good. Well, you shut it with someone in it, apparently. You know? Puppy? Yes, he's a good puppy. He follows me. See, watch. <laughs> He's a good boy, see? <laughs> good luck, Queen. Thank you, Queen. You as well. Hope you're having a good day. Hope you have something delicious to eat today. Treat yourself with some cheesecake. He wants to eat your mitochondria? No. He's m he has his own. He has his own mitochondria. I think animals have mitochondria. No, you? I will. I bought some cheesecake yesterday. <laughs> I'm gonna have some cheesecake tomorrow. But thank you. <laughs> Let's go back. Do I have a wrench? Did he give it to me? Did he give me a wrench? Oh, he said it's in here somewhere. This trunk, pretty bad shape. Can't believe it still runs. I need a wrench, though. Wrench? Messy desk. 
Wrench. 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 And reply a screwdriver's wrench. Yes! This might be useful. Yes. Sure, Mr. Douglas won't mind. No, because we asked before. We did it. Hey, wanna share it with me? I will share the cheesecake. Everyone gets a little piece. It's only one slice of a cheesecake, so we have to all get very tiny pieces. We only get one little bite. Monkey wrench. Because it's only one slice. Whenever I run errands that I don't want to do, like food shopping, I always make sure to give myself a little treat. So then I could reward myself for doing that thing that I didn't want to do. So I went food shopping yesterday. Even though I knew it was going to be a big task. And I bought myself a slice of cheesecake. The tiniest possible piece of a slice. <laughs> it's just one little bite. I'll take a middle circle. No, no, no. You just get one little tiny bite. Thanks. Eat the whole cheese. No, that's not how you share. That's not how you be considerate of others. You don't just eat the whole thing. Gotta be considerate. Make sure everyone gets their own little bite. Hey, Tony. Cake well earned. Yeah, man. I was so exhausted yesterday. All day yesterday after going food shopping. Right, no problem. I'll let Hal know when he gets back. Okay, later. So exhausted yesterday. It's not the food shopping part that makes me exhausted. It's the putting the food away once you get home part that gets me exhausted. That's the part I don't like. It's a crumb. It's more than a crumb. You guys get more than a crumb, I promise. I never gave consent. To me sharing with others, only to share it with you. I know, but if one person gets some, everyone has to get some. You know, remember when you were in school and it, the teacher told you, well, if you're gonna have a piece of gum, you have to share with the whole class. You have to give everyone a piece of gum. That's what it's like. Everyone gets a piece. That means you get to share sheepy's crumb. <laughs> that is true. Share my gum with everyone? Nah. Exactly. So then you can't have a piece of gum. Because you have to share with everyone else in class. Everyone has to get some. Can't leave anyone out. Let's go save this screaming person. Also, I kind of think I should change my gun because I'm scared. And I kind of like this one, because I don't know. Is it this one? No, it's this one. I don't know, we'll see. I don't like the screaming! <laughs> I really don't. <laughs> The dresser was covering a big hole in the wall. I don't like. Stop it. Nothing of interest here. there. This is not the same guy who was after us before, was it? I'm not sure if it is. He was in a similar outfit, but I think he had a mask on. Remember? 
It's you from the top. It is him. <laughs> okay, you're still chasing me. Why did you kill this woman? Woman. <laughs> you mean this thing? I'm just like you, little girl. Hmm, does he have special mitochondria? We both hunt that we may live. Do you know how many people you killed? When that town exploded? Murderer. Heh, <laughs> just a few dozen. You should thank me, little girl. I saved LA, LA last night. Who are you? What do you have to do with these creatures? Oh, you're gonna kill me? Go ahead. Or my conjurer will have the last laugh. <laughs> Alright, I don't like this guy. Oh, I don't have any power on me. I don't have any power. I forgot I used it all to heal. And I was gonna push him with my fire blast. And now I can't do that. But now I have to reload and it's gonna make me get hit. Watch. Oh, you get hit! Please die. he was gonna still be blinded and I was gonna be able to run. It didn't give me time to drink my cola! <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna be able to do it. I ran out of bullets and I don't think I could change my gun for when in battle. Nope. Nope. We're gonna die. Yep. Kill me, sir. I'm gonna put my other gun on. any more fire. I don't have any more MP. That poor lady for shame. Wow, <laughs> this guy needs glasses. He's fine. He has no depth perception. He's fine. Looks like half to have to. Oh, looks like half to time the fire. Oh, oh you mean the fire that I was doing? The fire attacks? Maybe. 
And she be told me why Ain't nothing but a heartache Tell me why Ain't nothing but a mistake Tell me why I never <laughs> Is that what you were saying, Luke? <laughs> Wanna hear you say I want it that way Cause I want it that way This one <laughs> First did like 140, the other ones did 15-ish, so can't spam it. That's definitely interesting design. Yes! Game design! Do I have my wrench? Yes, okay. So it was right before I went in there. Alright, so don't change my gun. <laughs> Don't change my gun. So keep this gun. Yes. Oh, inventory full. Do I have too many things? Okay. Yes, brain cells. We share brain cells. <laughs> we gotta go into Discord one day and just have karaoke since we can't have it on Twitch. We just gotta have it in the Discord. It's just a bunch of us singing random songs. Attaching weapons allows switching them in mid-combat. Make absolutely sure that an attached weapon is loaded or it won't shoot. The activity equipped weapon pretty much functions like an additional attachment slot as well. Found out on the internet, attach weapons to armor allows you to switch. Yeah, if you attach them to your, your belt, which is... This little thing right here, but you only get a few slots depending on um, what armor you have. So if I wanted to attach my other gun, I would have to attach the gun and the bullets, which would leave me with only one slot with a recovery item because I have my GPS on, which is the map. I have my bullets for this gun, and then I have the combat light. Um, so, yeah. You could take the guns with you, but you have to put them on your belt of what's on your armor. And uh, your armor only gets you a few slots. It's gonna say there's no way you're just soft locked if you run out of ammo. Well, it's because I didn't have both guns and both ammos on me. I only had the one. You don't need to touch bullets as long as you load the gun first. Bofa? I think my gun should be loaded. Loaded and ready. Should be. Alright, let's go back in. Let's go back in now, I'm ready. I'm gonna beat him up so hard, he's not gonna know what was coming. I never wanna hear you say I want it that way Cause I want it through Who's your favorite Backstreet Boy, guys? Who's your favorite? You know, was it Nick? Everyone liked Nick because Nick was like the pretty boy, you know? Everyone liked Nick or they liked Brian because Brian was like the leader or whatever. 
I liked AJ because he was like the more rockish bad boy. Favorite what? Backstreet Boy. What was your favorite Backstreet Boy? Never cared for them. I don't know their names. I just know Nick, Brian, AJ. I think there was two others and I can't remember their names. No idea because I don't know their names. <laughs> I just remember the two. That's it. I mean, the three of them, and that's the only ones I know. I only know that song. I think I know more, but I can't remember right now. I remember the Halloween one, where they, it was like a Halloween video. Back streets, back, alright. That one? Is that one? It... Yes, wow. this guy, by the way? Are we the same because we're both missed, or are we the same because we still- we both have mitochondria? Which I think he's- he does say that our mitochondria will laugh, so I think he probably has something involved with very powerful mitochondria? But why and how? Why does he call me little girl? Is it because I absorbed my sister's powers? And she was little when she did it because she was a child? sure when he was going to be able to reach me or not because some of those swipes he can't reach me. Sir. Out of HP, sir. Also, my bullets are not very strong, so that makes sense. But I like this gun because I have unlimited bullets from that box that I could use. My other gun might be stronger, but I have limited bullets on that one. I have to buy them from Douglas. on this side, but I thought he was close to me because of how the camera made his sword look.
Don't hit me. Aw, oh, damn. I thought he wasn't gonna be within reach. <laughs> I thought he wasn't gonna be within reach yet. That's why I stayed there. said I'm Eve's. Things are getting interesting. Eve? Aya? Aya? Oh no, Aya. Aya? Oh shoot. Aya, are you okay? Ooh. She did the same thing that uh, Eve did in part one. The first time when we met Eve and she just used her mind to put people on fire. Um, she did the exact same thing. Wow. That was cool and interesting. Yeah, he said you're Eve's. Wow. How does he know Eve? And obviously, Aya still has some trauma, understandably, about what happened three years ago with Eve and everything. Um, yeah, wow. I like how they they put that all together though. With the screen doing the wiggly wiggly thingy. And like the sound was kind of muted. And uh, that was really cool. Um, his laugh? Yeah, he's like... He, it kind of reminds me of that little dog guru guy from Crash Bandicoot. That's what his laugh reminds me of. So basically, all you need to do is run from corner to corner so you could do no damage. He was a lot harder the first time we fought him. Which I was going to say during, but I didn't want to jinx myself. But the first time we fought him, he was... I think he was using power. And he was a lot harder than what was happening here. So I was confused that this was what the fight was because the first time we fought him was not as easy. Uh, oh no. Damn, she burned him. He burned up? Yeah, understandably. Yeah, she has a lot of trauma still, obviously, from what happened in the first game. I wanna hug her. Yeah, or I, uh... Ripper Roo, he's my favorite. Yeah, that's what his laugh reminds me of. Ripper Roo. Aya, you okay? What is this? Is this Aya or Maya? Aya? Maybe? Can't tell. Oh shit, Aya. Are they running test on her? I'm a child. She escaped on her own. Maya, I think. I think this might be Maya also. Maya is uh, Aya's sister, who was the one who started with the mitochondria, the really powerful mitochondria. Um, and that's how Eve ended up getting 
very powerful was from Maya. So Maya was the one who started the whole thing, which is Aya's sister. But then at the end of part one, Maya absorbed her powers into Aya. So now Aya is the strongest one because she has her powers and then also the powers from Maya. Don't mess with her, she's upset right now. <sighs> wait, wait, wait. The old man told me you were gone. Oh, this is Kyle. <laughs> I remember by his name Kyle, not by his freaking last name. Uh, could you please point that thing elsewhere? I'm sorry. What happened here? Where'd he go? The music! The music from part one is back! I'm sorry, I just love the music from freaking part one. It was amazing music. And them, like, reusing it for part two just makes me so happy. He? I didn't see anyone but you. They just change it slightly. It's a little bit different than part one, but it's the same song. But it's changed slightly. But... Whoa there, you alright? I... I'm fine. Oh yeah. I talked to that old guy. He says the shelter is out in those hills. He's pretty sure the creature's nest is out there too. The nest? There's quite a ways out there, we'll have to go by car. Okay. Let's take my car. Now you're talking. Are we not gonna mention how she freaking put you on fire? Oh. I just need to pause for a minute because I just feel for Aya so bad. This girl has gone through so much and what was that cutscene? What was that cutscene? I don't know if that little kid was Maya or Aya. I'm guessing it was Maya. And uh, they were doing tests on her. And she ended up escaping. Oh, thank you for the follow. Thank you. I hope you're enjoying the game as much as I am. Because that cutscene, man. Whoa. And then, and then this Kyle guy puts a gun on us and Aya just turns up and puts him on fire because she's going through freaking traumatic moment right now. And, uh, man, did you see her face? Like, she was so serious. She was so serious. Wow. Woof. Okay, let me read what chat was saying. I'm back. I love my chonky cola. What happened? No. Now I'm having PST, PTSD. Are you having PTSD from the chonky cola? Oh, I don't need to be reminded of surgery. Oh, I'm sorry, Cryos. It's okay. She broke out of there. She broke out of there. I'm off now. See ya. Thank you for hanging out. See you later. That's neither, that's my friend Heather. No, that is either Maya or Aya. Maya, I think Maya became Eve. Yes, in part one, from what I think I remember and understand, Maya was the one with the most powerful mitochondria. Um, 
when she died in the car accident with Aya's mother, their mother, uh, she, I think, was like a donor and went into surgery. Or at some point went into surgery. I don't know if it's when she died or if it was before she died, but she went into surgery. And uh, that's where, I guess, Eve lived. Because even when it was in Maya, I guess it was still Eve somehow. Um, and uh, when she got surgery, it was the same time that Melissa got surgery. Melissa was the actress in part one in the opera who then turned into Eve because Eve took over her body. So the myochondria is Eve, but she goes into body to body. So she was in Maya's body originally and then went to Melissa's body, which is where we fought her and killed her or whatever. Um, and then kind of went into Aya's body. But then along with that, Maya also went into Aya's body. So Aya's like double strong myochondria now because I think she has all of it. She has Eve in there and possibly also Maya in there as well so yeah dude was about to kill her i know like as, as if he didn't even see me earlier he's pointing a gun at me and he said douglas told him that i went this way yeah he's gonna put a gun at me <laughs> damn man nah that was a prank <laughs> Man sure is come for having his burn his hand burned super hard after a failed assassin attempt. I know he's not gonna even be like, whoa, like she just did power out of her eyeballs. Like she just set me on fire out of her eyeballs just by looking at me. <laughs> like, you're not gonna bring that up? Ugh. <laughs> I thought Eve was like a thousand of years old. I maybe possibly yes. So uh, Eve was probably in other bodies before Maya, but she did end up in Maya's body, and then she ended up in Melissa's body. Um, so yeah, Eve. From yeah, now that you're mentioning it, I think they have said Eve existed for thousands of years. Um, her mitochondria essence, whatever she is, um. She just goes from body to body, I think. Let me hydrate. Hold on. And Aya went from her body to the opposite side of the church altar from me. <laughs> that means he knows more than he's letting on. Maybe. He might. Aya, you alright? You were in here a very long time. It was daytime earlier. Now it's nighttime. You okay? Oh, this guy has HP I have to look at. Also, look at that extra HP 100 up there. You mean I gotta protect this man? I don't wanna protect this man. You're telling me I have to protect this man. How about no? <laughs> There's a little girl's antique dress hanging here, alone. Maya wore a dress like this once. It got muddy. She was so mad. That girl. She looked just like Maya. What was she trying to tell me? Hmm. Also, I think there was a staircase before I entered this room is there a staircase going down is this a staircase oh no that's just uh wires on the ceiling i thought it was stairs fire 
because yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. She was tired from our sleep talk earlier. Um, I unlatch the door. I don't want to protect this man. What the hecky? Also, I should go back and, uh... And get more bullets. Because I probably used a bunch on this guy. Getting hit by that when they're dead. I can't step into their goop. Okay, I'm gonna go back and get more bullets because I think I probably used a lot from that other guy. But I just fought the. Their blood is poison. <gasps> that girl is poison. <laughs> Okay, let's go up and go to get more bullets and go save. And then... <gasps> no, 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 I wasn't ready. <laughs> I thought I was gonna be just running through. Oh my god. Ugh. Oh no. Those are the babies. Right? Oh no. They're the bats. I hate the bats. I hate the bats because they're, they're easy, but when they swarm together, they freaking get you. Baby squeak to you? That's what, I don't know. I don't think they squeak. Why does he just run in like... Like there is no danger. He doesn't stay back or anything. Look at what happened to my car, by the way. I thought that was gonna be our ride. And look what happened to my car. to get more bullets and save. I'm all the bullets. <laughs> all the bullets. All the bullets. I don't think this can hit them. They're too low to the ground. You gotta kill him, guy, because I, got, I don't got any more bullets, man. So it's all on you. <laughs> ah, my beautiful car. And just had it restored. You gotta be an engine. You could make it into the wall hanging? What wall hanging? So, what now? Look at Aya, she's so sad about it. <laughs> oh. oh, thank you for the bitsies. Thank you, Mr. Fox Hill. I give you huggies. <laughs> Please hug. I don't think you're driving out of here. I don't think so. Luckily, no babies have come in <laughs> to swarm me. Not yet. Not yet. Nah. 
They'll just buff out. The car will be fine. Mm -hmm. I hope so. The best feeling in the world is when you get accused by your pup. Uh, oh, so sorry. Oh, sorry. So, that's <laughs> accused by your puppy while well, trying to do stuff. What about pooping? <gasps> no pooping for the puppy. Oh! Yes, give me. Also, give me bullets. Because I didn't look at that other door that we came from because I thought I was gonna just get bullets and save here. So I actually want to go back because that back door, I didn't even look at. I can't save here? I have to find another phone. The phone's broken. Oh. Darn. What about the old man and dog? Yeah, I have to go there eventually also, but I want to go back here and see what was in this other place because I didn't look at it, com like, completely. I thought I was gonna... have a fun time and just come back and save. I can't even save. He didn't even come with me. <laughs> I thought he was supposed to be following me. The old man and the dog, are they okay? I'll check. I'll check in a minute. Hold on. Just want to make sure that nothing was over here. Because I didn't look at the whole way. Because I was worried about running out of bullets. inside the barrel. Absolutely nothing. There is something in- See, you liar. You said nothing was in the barrel, and then you checked again. You gotta make her check- Oh, it's the door from- It's just the back door. Okay, so it leads to the same place. I thought it was gonna lead to somewhere else. There are two barrels there, though. Want me to check the other barrel? Where's your friend? He's out here. He's out front. He's out front. He's out here. Does my trunk still work? I have stuff in that trunk. At least the trunk's fine. Guess I'm lucky, I guess. Okay, so my trunk still works. That's good. Okay. Beep. Put... I only have one slot left and I'm scared that I'm gonna run into something and it's gonna tell me that I don't have enough space. So I had to put something down. Okay, GPS. Reload my gun. No. Alright. <laughs> Can't reload my gun. Wrong button. Do I wanna no no I wanna take this one? There we go. Um recovery, recovery. Okay. 
move for this one here. Da -da -da! Don't know if I'm gonna need the flare, but I'll take it with me. Will an Abel pouch mean more inventory, or is this game calling me a weenie? Um, you could sometimes find belt pad, um, pouches, which I think I did, and it only gave me one slot extra. I could probably reload from the menu. Ooh, maybe. Yeah. Yeah! Hmm. Care package and hydrate does? I also have to go on a break to get Bubba his snacky. Stretchy! Mm. <sighs> Stretch! And I also need to get more water so I can hydrate more. The pouch slots apply to only the certain armor seat. Um, armor seats, yes. But I did find one and I did add it. I found one earlier. Like Resident Evil, yeah! I think the pouch was sitting in the trunk. I think I... I don't know where I found it. I can't remember. But there might be another one in the trunk, yeah. Better armor won't be able to add it on. Hmm. I see, I see. I'm gonna take a break. Yes, I'm about to break. And I'm about to break. Um. <laughs> I'm gonna give Bubba his snacky. For anyone that's new in Chatsies, Bubba's that little boy sitting next to you. That's my Baba. And I have to go get him a snack. I'm gonna probably get myself some more water while I'm at it. And I'm also gonna go pee. So if you need to go get a snack, or need to get more drinky drinksies, then uh, go do that as well. And we'll be back in like three minutes. I'm gonna probably play three minute ads just so commercials could run through. And uh, for the people that are subbed, you won't see any of the commercials, but you just have to be right back music. But it'll take like three minutes, three, four minutes. And then we'll be back. And then we'll play some more. Resident Evil, but the monsters are mutated animals instead of mutated humans. Exactly. Exactly. Yes, go get yourself a hamburger. Hamburger? Hamburger. Yes, go get yourself a hamburger in the next four minutes. And I'll be right back. You're allergic to cats! I'm sorry. I'm sorry you have to deal with it because the cat stays. The cat stays. He ain't going nowhere. The cat stays. Anyway, I'll be right back.
back. Papa got his snack. I got my water. Did you get a snacky chat, sis? Brother, I've got a snacky. <laughs> okay, let me drink some water. But half the master uh, master birds. Half the master birds and Resident Evil 1 are mutated animals. All of them are mutated animals. Not. I'm sorry I said that. Um no. no, no. Okay, where am I going? Guess we need new wheels. All right, let's go see uh, the old man. Are you coming or are you coming? No? He ain't coming. I hate these guys. With a passion, they run so fast. <laughs> Let me heal. They run so fast at you. Bam. <laughs> Let's see if we could see Douglas. Yes, up. Damn it. <laughs> he has a phone in there also that we can save with. My snacky. I ate the whole banana. Banana cake. I'm so good. I need to take a picture of it and show the Discord because it looks really fun and cute. Like it literally just looks like a banana. Scorpions are gonna come out. Spiders, though. Damn them. They disappear. No. Sound like that. What? Running's hard in this game.
Where's the other guy? My goodness me! Douglas, Flint, are you okay? It's just me. Oh, hiya. You okay? More or less. I was worried. Oh, you were worried about me, Douglas? That's very nice. How are you and Flint? Uh, Flint looks okay. He looks like he's calm and, and he's okay. <sighs> I would like to save. I would like to save on your phone, Douglas. Hello? Oh, it's Jody. Hiya, hiya, girlfriend. Long time no talk. We were worried about you. Pierce is so nervous. He's so nervous. He's pacing like a bear at the zoo. Hey, where'd he go? Well, whatever. Yes, that's right. Hell's still not back. I know, it's totally bizarre. It's not like him at all. Say, I wonder if... Nah, not a chance. Sorry, I'm just happy that you're safe. I got a little carried away. What? You're going to a shelter? Okay, okay. Hmm. She said Pierce is gone. Did Pierce come... Is Pierce on the way to save me? Is Pierce on the way to save my butt? Because my car is broken down and I need someone to save me. <laughs> <sighs> Over right, yes. Drink some more water. <sighs> what? Where's Flinta? Where's Flinta? Where's Flinta? Probably under the desk, and I can't see him. Need something? Show me your guns. Okay. Do I want another gun or do I want some more armor? I think I like armor. I think I like armor. Ba, 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 ba. We have enough for this now. Yeah? What'd you say, Jet? What'd you say? A P A. SGT vest plus 20 HP no added MP but that's all right uh, attachments six special features resist poison so those freaking things won't poison me and HP recovery you know or a shoulder harnessed which is not as great it just has quick fire and has four attachments compared to the six and it gives oh but it gives you mp mp or hp which do i want you know i want hp yes yes let's go let's go let's go let's go armor no oops wrong thing where's my armor there it is Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see, let's see. Oh, gotta put my things back on me. Oh, wrong thing. No, wrong thing. Sorry. Yes. Um, where's my gun? Where's my... Oh, I don't have to put my gun on here. Sorry, I thought I did. Bulletta. Lair. Um, recovery. Oh, down here. 
Yeah. Damn, hold on. I don't like this. I thought I was at the top of the list. No, no, no. I wanted to put it at the top. Everything is all sorted yucky. Fine. Hmm. Hmm. Don't need to carry this with me anymore, probably. Don't know. I'll just move this way. HP, always HP. Yes, I agree. Always HP. I love HP. Mm. Got more points to also upload, um, upgrade this stuff. Haven't used these things though, so I should probably test them before I even upgrade anymore. Hold on. I want to save again now that I got the armor. Just in case I forget or die. I don't want to have to buy it again and then equip all the stuff on myself again. Uh, tell me about the shelter again? I told you all I know. Alright, I forgot what you told me though. That's why I was asking again. Need something? I need a car. Mr. Douglas? I have a favor to ask? Huh? What now? Can I borrow a car? Going to the shelter? Yes. Hmm. Can I talk you out of it? No. Well, about the only one still moving, my own truck. And it just started leaking oil like there was no tomorrow. Can it be fixed? Eh, well, it'll take me a little while. I, uh, check out the motel while I'm working. Maybe you can find some kind of gasoline container. Thank you so much. Get going. Yes, sir. Okay, so now I have the keys to the other locked rooms. Alright, alright. Can she call headquarters and have one sent to her? Well, the one that was answering the phone was Jody, and she's in charge of weapons and uh selling me stuff she said my other guy who is usually there pierce left and he's gone and there was another guy there how he was also gone so i don't know <laughs> all of my people have left so uh now that we have the motel keys, there's there's room three, four, and then there's a lobby which has the little circle on it, which might be where I have to go. Okay, cool. Do I have to... Okay, I don't have to... Sometimes you have to press triangle on it, so I wanted to see if I had to do that. Okay, you stay safe, Mr. Douglas, sir, and you also, Flinta. Stay safe. Let's go back to the main area. Maybe we could tell... What was his name? Kyle? We could tell Kyle what's going on. 
Look! I want to see what this is. So I'm gonna use it. Thank you for the hat pantsers. I love hat pantsers. Them. Oh, they're behind the car. That's great. I wasn't hitting them. No, no, no. Ooh. Ooh. Thank you for the head patch and the bonkies and the head patch. Hi, Pico. Thank you. Save the bonks for the monster and Quack likes to bully me. Sound like a what? Like a ducky? Like a quack quack? You sound like quack quack. Don't they? I think they do. Going to the front to save first and get more bullets, and then I'll go where I have to go. Which is these doors and uh, the lobby, I think it said on the map. Oh! Kyle's gone. I was dead. Good riddance. I didn't want to protect his butt anyway. Happy he's gone. Okay. Mapu. Is it this door? No. It's these two. I can't use the key? Is this not the key for this? Oh, it's just for the lobby? Oh, I thought it was for all of the doors. Okay. I understand. So... How do I get there? How do I get? 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 Get 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 get? How do I get? This way? Yes. 
I think I remember. Is it that big blue door? Is it this? Yes. Open the door with the lobby key. Can there be a phone in here? I will very much appreciate. Thank you. Very much appreciated. Yes, I don't. I wasn't looking at the photo on the wall, Aya. Um, I was trying to get to the phone. <laughs> Okie dokie, I'll talk to Hal. Sure thing, as soon as he gets back. Bye now, be careful. Yeah, and Jolie's the only one that's there, and Jolie can't really do much for me. So, no headquarters. Okay. Let's see. Nice lobby. Can I write my name in the book? Guess leader. Lots of white spaces. Guess this is the middle of the desert. Probably get a lot of tired long distance long distance truckers. Some hitchhikers heading west. Wait a sec. The book is full for the first three months of 98. It's the same people for all three months. January 1998. That was right after the New York incident. No. It must be a coincidence. No point taking down names. They're probably Alice's. Alice's. What are the names on the book, Aya? Also, that is something that you could have missed because I had to press that multiple times for her to say all of that. Aya, can you read it, please? I'm interested in to know whose names are on there. There's a memo posted here. When death came to Tombstone, Holiday was 30 and Ip was... Not bad for gunsmen of the Old West. The secret to long life, good friends, and good luck. Okay. Yeah, you have to press things multiple times because then... Sometimes she finds something or she adds something. Written memo. Problems with the cash register. Don't forget. Press number before entering the four-digit code and press total when you're done. Can't remember the number? Check the still and you will. Check the still and you will. Some... Irritated manager, manager probably wrote this for the part-time help. No, 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 I didn't mean to press that. I was trying to press the thing next to it. Hmm... Cash register. One of these days, though, I'm gonna remember. I'm gonna, like, press a random number in and it's gonna be like, Yes, you're right! And we'll be like, Oh my god, I'm so magical! One of these days. Check the still? What? What do they mean, check the still? The photo? Still? 1881. 1881? Is that what they mean by the still? Still image? <laughs> Am I smart that? Am I? Oh, 
I'm not sorry. <laughs> I thought I was gonna. Sheepy, by the way, you're cool and nice and funny and wholesome and a good streamer and a gay friend. And I'm glad to have met you. Oh, Luke, thank you so much. You as well. You as well. Damn, I thought I was a smart uh. I thought, like, you know, the still image, it would tell me what it... <sighs> Do I have it? Do I have... I have a still photo. Oh. Um... Map... Key... Cola... Huh. I'm gonna lurk now. Have a fun stream and a good rest of your day. Thank you, Luke. You as well. Nice to see you like always. Mm. I'm gonna look at the walkthrough. You can't stop me. I wanna know where the thing is. And you can't stop me. Okay. Let me see. Okay, my car is totaled. Yes. Go to Douglas. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Lobby key. Uh, check the instructions on the wall behind the counter. If you can't, don't want to figure it out, use Wikipedia. Highlight this code. Copy. Let me see. The cheetah. The cheetah. 3033. Where is that coming from, though? Um, where's the 3033 coming from? Hmm. Okay. Um. Okay. So I get the new key, and then also they told me a little highlight that's an important note. Once you get this key, it triggers a new wave of enemies. Um, and you could explore the rest of the rooms that are locked. And I could still buy from Douglas in the garage. However, once you have a gasoline-filled jerry can, you can't talk to him without triggering the next wave of enemies. Therefore, I recommend only filling it up once after you've done everything else. Um, I guess I'll understand a little bit of that later. But that's good to know that I guess whenever you talk to him, it just um triggers the enemies again. So the passcode is 3033, which I don't know where that passcode came from. Why you take Jerry Jerry's can? Because Jerry doesn't need it anymore. Three. Oh. Three. Oh. Three, three. Total. <laughs> That's his can. He said that he's buying a new one. And I can use this one now. It was very nice of him. Very nice of him. I made sure to say thank you. And I offered to get him something as a, like, a thank you. But he said no, 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 no. He said no. He said he was more than happy to do it. Hell, you're gonna use a used can. Of course I'm gonna disinfect it and sterilize it and put it in, like, boiling hot water. I talked to Hal, Hal. Sure thing as soon as he gets back. Okay, so Hal's not back yet. I don't know who Hal is. I can't remember. I'm gonna save on the top one. So this makes it now that... We could go into room, uh, oopsie, room three and room four. I think those were the only ones that were locked, right? 
There's another one upstairs. No, that's the water hole that... Oh, there's the la- Oh, yeah, there's upstairs where the room 5 and the lobby are. Okay. So it, it's best to just go to room 5 and the loft. And then go to room 4 and 3 on the way back to... Uh, Douglas. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, because room three, one of the lock rooms are up there, along with the loft. But I think we're gonna do that next Wednesday, because I am over, I'm going soon over my time. I'm almost at my three hour mark. So, we're gonna do that next Wednesday. We're gonna run and finish looking at the empty rooms, get the gas, Jerry gas tank thingy for... Douglas, and then we could get a car, and then we could get out of this place. Mm. Mm. But on Friday, I'll be back with Yakuza 3, which we're almost finished with. I think we have like four more chapters, which go by pretty quick if you're not doing side quests and like side stories and leveling up. Those... Uh, chapters in Yakuza could go by very quickly. So, I don't know what we're gonna do on Friday. If I'm gonna wanna do some side quest or do some story. I'm not sure yet. I don't know. But that's gonna be on Friday. And then we have the weekend. And I won't be here for the weekend. Until Monday. But, yeah. Thank you for hanging out with me, you guys. I hope you're enjoying this game as much as I'm enjoying this game. Because I love this game so much so far. And I'm really much, very much enjoying it. And I can't wait to see more, uh... More story. With what was that cutscene with that kid? Was that Maya? What the hell's going on? Also, I want to hear more about Aya's traumatic, like... PTSD that she has going on that hap from what happened three years ago in New York. Like... I want more of that. Like, that is so cool. I want to know what happens. So, we'll get back to that next Wednesday. Can't wait. I'm having lots of fun with it. And, uh, let's see if there's someone for us to raid. If not, because most of the time there isn't, then you guys could go wherever you damn well please. Go wherever you damn well please. <gasps> let's turn you in a whimsy. We haven't sent you the Whimsy in a while. Whimsy's making candy bracelets. Uh, which I want to do one day on stream also. I have to... have to. If you don't know what candy bracelets are, they're also like... I forget what the other name for them are. But they're usually what like ravers wear. And they're like really co colorful, fun colors. And uh, so I want to... I want to do a stream one day where I make candy bracelets for my friends. But the thing is, I got to order a bunch of beads. And um, I usually do that from AliExpress. Because they have them for very cheap. And they have a very wide selection. But um, the thing is, they're coming from China. So it takes a, like months sometimes to get to you. But I really want to put an order in and get a bunch of new beads. Because... I don't have that many right now in order to make the bracelets that I want to make. And uh, I also want to make a top out of them. Like, th like there's a bra thing that you can make and I want to make one. <laughs> I don't want to do it on stream. Um, I just, I have to buy the beads and I have to figure out the camera situation because um, I'm very scared about having any cam because I'm scared I'm going to tip it over and then dox myself. But I really want to do a candy bracelet stream and just make a fun a bunch of my friends bracelets. So then I could send them friendship bracelets. And uh, you guys could watch me make them. But that's what Whimsy is doing right now. Whimsy is making some candy bracelets. Peach is there, which earlier I thought that Peach was not going to be there. Because Peach was uh, 
stuck at work, so Paige is also there, which is great. So we're gonna send you the whimsy. Whimsy's pronouns are she, her, while Peach's pronouns are they, them. And uh, Whimsy is an artist. She has a lot of VTuber children. She not only does art, but she also does rigging for a lot of VTuber children and her own model as well. She is the one that has, who did the praise sheepy redeem and the throat redeem. Those are done by Whimsy and they're on her coffee. Uh, free to use, I think. And, uh, yeah. So she's amazing. She's great. Also, Peach is amazing. They're great. I love them so much. Uh, whenever I could talk about Shiny with Peach is a great time. <laughs> so I'm gonna send you guys to them. Because I haven't in a while. And I'm gonna go see the candy bracelet making. So... I'm gonna send you guys to Whimsy. Yes, the immersion is a little bit broken because you could see Whimsy's handsies. But too bad. I love Whimsy. Love them. Love them both. Whimsy's also the waifu to Tiggy. Tiggy's another person that I love so much. And uh Tiggy was the first person first first VTuber I ever witnessed and watched and became friends with. Uh and yeah, so it's like I know the whole family. So yeah, I'm gonna send you guys there. If you like Whimsy and Peach, make sure to give them a follow because it's very important that. And if you like art and need a VTuber mama or anything really, art, emotes, assets, anything, Whimsy does it. So. Ask about her commissions if you like. And yeah. I'll see you guys on Friday. Sorry for my big ramble. I just like candy bracelets. And I like whimsy. So, you know. I did a little bit of a ramble ramble there. But I'm gonna send you guys now. And I'll see you guys on Friday. Love you very much. Bye bye. Mm.